Welcome back, folks, to Let's Play Ultima Underworld 2. And when last we left off, we got eliminated those headless that were just, uh, on the next level of the Undercastle, and we had managed to, uh, talk to various people in the castle. Found out that, um, Lady Tori suspects that something is up with Feridwin, and that we managed to resolve the strike. The strike is actually a thing that can really, really mess up a game uh, playthrough of this because the strike can bug and if you're very if you're not careful the strike can be really really bad for you but for now we're going to head down into this area because we have something that uh, will be useful namely we have a key we have a key to the armory the armory is over here we need this key and we need to see what's in here there we go, if we uh, use the key, it unlocks the door, and in here is some very, very good equipment. And we are talking very good equipment. We are talking uh, breastplates that are worn rather than badly worn. And a badly worn helmet, still pretty decent. What else do we have? Uh, very nice shields. Don't use that. We. Uh, have more equipment like that. We also have a better, um, you notice there we also have a better, um, shield there. A much better one. There's a uh, metal shield. And a fair amount of, uh, weapons. Like, there is a broadsword here. I don't know if a broadsword is better than a short sword. It looks like it might be better. I mean, this is a long sword. We'll stick with the long sword for now. now is this a badly worn helmet? Yeah, this is, but that armor is slightly better. So actually, we're going to take this armor off and put that there. And we're going to put this armor on, because this armor is a little better. There we go. What else do we have? Is there any... Uh... Okay, there's a lot of broken weapons there. Here is a worn tower shield. We want that. We are going to equip that. It's probably going to be very heavy. It's pretty heavy, but we have a nice selection of equipment now. Basically, if you wanted any kind of weapon, here is where it is. And we probably want to lock this on our way out. I think we're going to stick with the uh, longsword for now. I don't know how good the broadsword is. And while we're here, we might as well actually get rid of some of the equipment that we're not currently using at all. Like, we don't need this. We don't need that. We also don't need this either. We, we need some inventory space. We are, after all, carrying 91 gold. Do we really need 91 gold? I don't know. We probably want to eat some cheese, though. Cheese, after all, is very tasty. Excellent. It tasted great. What else do we have? We have this one here that just has a bag with practically nothing in it. And lots of scrolls, and another bag that has more random stuff in it that we probably don't need. We're, we probably don't need this bottle here. And we can put the food there. We can eat the food, I wager. There we go. That tasted great. We have more carrying capacity now, which is good. It's much better. We can also um, just uh, use the stairs down here to go get access to the... Oh, yes. Better lock the door, eh? We don't want anybody to uh, get access to here. There you go. You can actually lock doors that are already unlocked if you have the key, which is good. We most certainly wanted to lock that door. And this leads to down here. That leads uh, down. We're actually going to rest here, I think. There we go. We are mildly hungry. Fortunately, we have a few pieces of food that we can eat. I think there's some cheese here. It may have tasted bland, but uh, we have access to more food where that came from. Is there any more food where that came from? Ah, there is no room to create it. Therefore, we uh, couldn't make any food. There we go. We should probably uh, make some food. Also, we probably want to do a little bit of... Um, Probably want to do a little bit more training. We probably want some more casting skill. We do have an extra level, 
to uh, play around with. We have two levels, actually. We could gain one apiece. That seems like a good idea before we actually leave. See, if we go up here, it'll take us straight into the uh, castle itself. And we can go find Nistel. Nistel will do some training for us. A bit of uh, magic and casting, and uh, we'll be good to go. I mean, they're pretty equal, aren't they? Or do we need a little bit more mana? Casting is 12, and mana is 10. One apiece, I think, will do the trick. One apiece. We just need to find where Nistel is. Nistel should be in this room over here to the left. But if he's actually going to be there is another question. Let's find out. Nistel, are you here? Typically, of course, you are not. You can't rely on them being where they actually are on the map after a certain while. We could report into Miranda, but there is zero point because we have done precisely nothing. Everyone's pretty much in here right now, except Nistel. Nistel we sort of want here, and he's the one person that's not here. Nistel? Where is Nistel? That is actually a really good point. Where is Nistel? That's not Nistel. Nistel is here. Excellent. That is who I want to see. I need you to teach me. I need to be taught in the, uh casting and I also need to be taught in mana there we go that is useful because we need more casting and more mana the mana is now up to 27 and our casting skill is also probably pretty impressive also I uh, don't think we need a bone really don't think we need a bone right now so uh, we have no bone to pick with anyone <laughs> uh, maybe with Feridwin but I highly doubt it, because I trust Ferretwin, even if Lady Tori doesn't. Lady Tori only has a motion to go on, whereas I have a hunch that there is nothing wrong with um, our good friend Ferretwin. Also, we are now level, what, eight? We get one more level, we should be able to start casting that repair spell that uh, we were hinted at. The repair spell is going to be pretty important. We're most certainly going to need because we do not have any repair skill to speak of. So now that we're back down here, we might as well just um, go and head back to the um, Killorn Keep and inform everyone that we have managed to... Uh, well, not inform everyone. Inform Altara that we have managed to um, get past the um, problem of the listener. And then from there, we will see what else needs to be done. We need to find this gem. We know there is one somewhere here. So this one... Oh, hang on. They are alternating. Did you see that? They alternated. This one leads to... Ah, we're back in Kilorn Keep. The happiest place in all of the worlds. I'm lying. This place is not happy at all. Right, let's go find... Um... Hello? Thank you. I just want to go this way. Don't mind me. I've defeated the listener! How may I help the Avatar? The listener is dead. So thou hast disposed of the Guardian's Watcher? Then thou art trustworthy after all. Tis well, as I have need of an ally who can travel the plains. And I shall be back one moment. And we are back! Apologies for that. Let us continue. For indeed, we could now ask uh, what we can do for Altara. Alternatively, we can just be very rude and say that we were offended that uh, she didn't trust us. However, I think the first option is the best one. What may I do for thee? She shows you a black pearl. I had almost succeeded in placing a powerful enchantment in this pearl. It lacks only two rare elements, the egg of a dread spider and an amethyst rod. Once complete, it will become a powerful weapon in this fight. Ah, we know where some um, dread spider eggs are. I will obtain the components. Here, take the pearl with thee and bring it back with the components. Ooh, before I go, I have noticed that thou dost practice runic magic. Wilt thou take these, Shana, as my gift? Yes, I will. 
Yes, yes, I will, because, uh... Yep, I definitely need them. I need all those. Let's, uh, make some room. Let's put that in there, and, uh... Let's do these. You go, uh, I am in thy debt. Thou art welcome. Here is a, a quaz, a an, and a corp runestone. We'll put all of these in our rune bag because we need them. Farewell. May good fortune go with thee. We needed all of those, I believe. Yep, we needed all of those. Now we have a pretty significant uh, increased selection of... Uh, things that we can do. We know where to get a, um, we know where to get a, uh, actual, uh, set of spider eggs. There is an unblemished black pearl. Interesting that, um, you found that. Um, I wonder if it's actually linked to the one that is meant to be here, or is this a completely different one? But, uh, we most certainly will, uh, find those, um, two things for you. An amethyst rod might be the tricky part. I don't know where we'll find one of those. But I know we can find some um, eggs of a dread spider. That's the good news. The bad news is, is we're going to have to go over here and uh, explore in the oubliette some more. We need to find where exactly... Um, also, we could do some trading. I mean, are you guys still upset with me? You are upset. I'm still going to do some trading. So thou hast come back, huh? What does thou want this time? Um, I've got some food, I think, though it is mouldy, likely as not. I've some weapons from my father's old stock, and maybe some armor, though I cannot vouch for the quality. I may even have some magical items. To be honest, it's been a long time since I've taken a proper inventory. I'm surprised thou art still in business. Think thee that I have any interest in thy worthless opinions? Get thee from my sight. Oh. Well, we might as well see what he has to say. Yes, I would like to make a purchase. And, uh, I am still interested in making a purchase. Yes. You have nothing of interest. And I'm curious. It's it's only a day old. That's, that's not so bad. You did say it might have been moldy. But it turns out it, uh... It was not. Let's head over here and into the uh, the pantry area and go to the oubliette. There is, I'm pretty sure, somewhere down here that we have not yet been. I just need to find how to get there. I just need to find how to get there. I get the feeling there is a secret door that I have not found. It might be in here. I get the feeling it might be in here. Let's have a look. Natural stone walls. Natural stone walls. Loads of natural stone walls. And this is this room? Hmm. I just get the feeling there is something I'm missing. I need to get through that, um, that, that's a gated area. Natural stone walls. There is no secret at all, is there? No, no there is not. Hmm, and I think the ability to open locks, if I'm checking my runes, um... Yeah, it's a fifth circle spell, which means it's out of my ability to cast. Hmm... I just get the feeling there is some sort of area I've not yet been to. For instance... The fact that there was, there isn't, there's a tiny gap there. There's a tiny gap on the map. Aha! Excellent. There was a tiny gap in the map. Searching pays off. But I'm not going to presume that there aren't enemies down here. There's going to be enemies down here. Are we approaching the oubliette? Hmm. There's a trap here. That is very, very suspicious. I'm not even going to step in that. Away with you! Yep. Remember that, um, 
They said that Rel could plan something? There we go. I think that might have solved it. Also, there are headless, perhaps attracted by the source of light. Let's see if that has dealt with whatever trap was here. Yes, yes it had. Also, yep, indeed. In the oubliette, there is a, uh, there is in fact a gem. Do you see it? We're gonna go and, uh, get it. We have to fight these headless to get it, but, uh, also you can see that uh, the oubliette is, uh, where they throw people to die. Because, uh, there is a skeleton here. Unless somebody else had tried to, uh, basically, um, get what was in here. Maybe this is where Relk throws people to die. Two headless is not the best. We really want to focus on one, and this one is a good one to focus on. Because this one has already been hurt. We've dealt with headless before, though. There was some laughter there. Is that the Guardian? I wonder if that's the Guardian laughing at us. Perhaps the Guardian should not be laughing so much now that we're about to win. Ah, two headless are no match for me anymore. Excellent. This is a square gem. But it is indeed a uh, cool black rock gem. And there is a sword here. A serviceable longsword. We might as well take it. It might even be magical. It does not look magical, but we'll take it. We could always do with a replacement. So yeah, I don't think uh, going in the uh, through there without moving those candles, I think that was a terrible idea if we hadn't moved those candles. Also, let's do that. Which uh, opens up... Ah, it opens up this way. So in actual fact, it was impossible to go through that door, that uh, gated area there. So we actually now have a, um, we now have another gem, which is actually a really good thing to see. We did need another gem. We did need another gem. So let's just uh, heal up a little. Also, you'll notice that uh, that didn't uh, fail at all. But I don't think there's much else we need to do in this area right now. One more level, I think, and then we'll be able to uh, start repairing our equipment. If you'll move out the way, Mr. Guard, I just need to uh, go to another world. Don't mind me. And please don't follow. I'm not even sure you can follow. It may only be me that can follow. Okay, we're back here now, and I think that uh, Lurker was trying to take a swipe at me. <laughs> we should probably show um, Nistal this uh, gem that we've got. That seems like a good idea. That seems like a pretty good idea. We should show him the gem, because after all, this is progress. Let's head upstairs. And upstairs we go. Excellent. Let's show Nistel what we have. It's all progress in the end. Finding things, chanting things, and we can have a word with everyone else and see what's going on. Let's head into the actual castle itself, and let's find everyone. First, Nistel. Nistel was in the throne room last time I saw him. He's still in the throne room. Excellent. What brings thee to see me, Avatar? I have this. I have a gem for thee to treat. May I examine it? Certainly. Sir. Nistel performs a gesture and incantation. He hands the gem, now heated by his magic, back to you. Try this now, then. Hast thou any other? Hast thou any others thou wouldst have me treat? No, not yet. <laughs> not yet, because I don't think the other one's ready just yet. Who else is here? There is a guard, and there is also that bone that we left. And there is also, um, Nana. We might as well go and talk to Miranda while we're here and, uh, see what's happening. There's a lot of people in this room. In fact, there's pretty much everyone in this room right now. Let's, uh, speak to Miranda. Good to see thee again, Shana. Uh, there's nothing else to really talk about, therefore. It would seem like there's nothing else that's going to happen. 
But we have this gem, and we might as well go down and use that gem on the, uh, area in question, down by the actual big black rock gem. So, when we do that, we'll be next time, for I'll catch you next time, folks. And I'll see you then, for when we come back, we'll head down again, still better on than we were before, and we will, um, use this gem. Use this gem and see what happens. So, I'll catch you next time, folks. And I'll see you then. Later. It's all going so well. And I'm sure it will continue to go absolutely perfectly. Right? Right?